and I just ended up falling on my tailbone. What is up you guys and welcome back to my channel. So I am currently uploading the holiday decor declutter slash I shaved Coco slash a lot of stuff because I talked a lot in this video. But yeah, that's currently processing. So I'm going to try my best not to talk a lot in this segment before we actually do stuff. Also, Ginger is in the background. I've said it many times in the vlogs. She's just old and she just pants. Speaking of, I think I need to take her to the vet because of that. I don't think that's normal. If there's any vet techs, please let me know if that's normal for an old dog. Okay, so I'm probably not going to shave Coco today, mainly because it is hot, like super, super hot outside. And let me actually see how hot it is. Oh, we are having a heat wave. Our forecast for the whole entire week. Yes. Oh, damn it, I was gonna... I'm gonna I'm gonna risk that I don't um, so I'm not going to shave her mainly because of like it's literally 93 degrees right now so yeah I'm gonna wait until this heat wave leaves which is like in two weeks for me to completely shave her okay that's all I kind of wanted to tell you guys about Coco now I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put this as the title but we are going to try my skates I was gonna say ice skates but they're not ice skates they are literal literal inline artistic skates I don't know the proper name for it try to do some jumps like probably like a waltz jump be a two foot spin and then if I'm feeling confident I would probably do other jumps and a single like a one foot spin but yeah I'm gonna I haven't tried them on yet I still have to like actually yeah, let me let me show you because I clearly do not know how to talk it is this. I still need to bring the laces up, basically, but these are super cute. <laughs> I don't know if I like made it clear in the last vlog, but these were the these were the boots that I bought when I first started as an adult skater, and I will say um, I broke them in pretty pretty quick. I don't know why, but yeah, they got broken in super super quick and that is why I had to switch the pianos I, I have a full video of that if you want to see it I'm gonna show you the thumbnail right here but yeah if you want to see it I'll link it down below or it'll be in the end credits these have been like sold out since quarantine started which is why I'm barely getting them right now people are probably like why did you buy these when you already bought skates like the quad skates I bought the quad skates Mainly because I really just wanted something to skate with. But then I later found out that I couldn't really jump or spin with them because of the toe pick part. And like I know like there's there's like artistic skating where they use quads, but this toe I don't know what it's called. I'm gonna i I'm still gonna call it toe pick. This like toe pick thingy was too high for me for doing any jumps or spins or whatever. So yeah. I couldn't really use them for tricks basically so this is that's why I got these okay I'm at like, like 10 minutes like here I was thinking like oh it's gonna be a quick three minute intro but no I'm just talking while I'm waiting for my um friggin while waiting for my video to process I'm just gonna go ahead and let this upload right now and I'll get back to you guys when we start trying these bad boys out <laughs> okay the time has come and we're gonna go ahead and try these out let's go outside i'm kind of already assuming it's gonna be like super super hot once i open the door so i'm gonna get you guys into my reaction to the blast of heat that's gonna hit me oh yeah it's freaking hot i'm gonna try these out i'm gonna try to skate with these probably gonna spray some on my shoulders leave it I don't know. She reminds me of a wild dog in the desert. I see that. So I had to go through my actual ice skating bag to get these. Yeah. We're gonna just put them on just so I don't hurt myself. I know I bought some when I got the blue, the pink ones, the roller, the quad ones. But I don't know where they are. Boom. Neck and lucky. Oh, these are also my skating socks. So just ignore that. They're just skating socks. They're not supposed to look cute. They're not tight, but like, I can't. I need to 
you break them in. They are very stiff. Hey, I'm already red. Okay, so they are on. They are definitely like loose, but that I think is because I can't really tie them properly right now since they are brand, brand new. This is like this, this is what happened last time. I was freaking red because I decided to skate on a hot day. Let's try and skate with these. Kind of nervous because I don't have any wrist guards. I'm gonna put you here for a moment while I try getting up. Weird. The wheels are definitely not very smooth. I think I might have to loosen them up a little bit. Unless there's supposed to be that amount of sure. But we're gonna try to skate with them like that for the meantime. But I need some sunscreen on my body. Okay, that was just like one minute of me like just trying them out and they are very like stiff I think I'm gonna go ahead and like go around my block very quickly just to wear them in I I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do like a two-day thing because like today's gonna be I can already tell my feet are hurting right now yeah I'm gonna go ahead and film with my my phone so I'm gonna take this big camera in the neighborhood so yeah I'll see you guys in a second I cannot do a three turn. I thought I was gonna be able to do a three turn, but I can't. It's like obviously a roller skates and like my phone ended up overheating, so I don't know how much of it I got. Okay, I did one clip where you can see my my skates where you can see my face. But yeah, these I need to break these in a lot more, but I definitely have to work on edges first. I tried doing like a like I said, I tried doing a three turn and I cannot for the life of me do a three turn. I don't know. I thought they were going to be easier, but they're a bit more stiffer than obviously like blade on an ice. This will be day one. I'm probably going to do a second day. I'll see you the next day. Also, my feet are killing me right now. <laughs> my ankles are dead. Okay, so I was going to skate today, but there was something that happened yesterday after that clip that you just saw. Yeah, I was trying to film on my phone for a little bit so I could post something on my ice skating page on Instagram. And yeah, I was just doing backward swizzles, just like simple stuff, simple stuff. And I just ended up falling on my tailbone. You, you would think that the tailbone would start being sore and, and bruised and all that. No, no, no. It went up my spine and it kind of got my, like right here, like in between the shoulder blades, not on the spine, but it's on my left shoulder blade. I don't know how the hell that happened. There's no bruising at all, but like yesterday I couldn't turn my head. I still can't turn my head all the way. This is like the most I could do without it hurting. And then obviously like this way I could turn it all the way, but like I just can't turn my head all the way to my left side or also start hurting and feeling a little slight pain. Just like right where the shoulder blade is, I, I believe like, it got there. I don't know how the hell it got there. Any movement just hurt so bad. But I ended up taking some pills and my mom gave me some like CBD lotion to help with the pain too. And afterwards, I actually just decided to go in the pool because it is like going in the pool is considered therapeutic. So my mom was just like, go in the water, it should make you feel better. And honestly, it made me feel a lot better. Like, like after that, I felt no pain whatsoever. But then I woke up today and my wrist started hurting right here. So I don't 
know what happened and sadly it would have been recorded but i forgot that with the heat um and it and your phone being on direct sun it overheats and it just shuts down so sadly there's no footage of that bit of that fall or else i would put it in this video and i would have wanted to see how the hell i fell to make it go up my spine and my wrists i don't remember myself going on my wrists to stop my fall i just remember myself falling backwards and hitting my tailbone i'm probably gonna have to end the video here and i will update you guys on a, a follow-up video and probably i'll probably skate again when i feel a lot better from these like slight injuries i consider these slight injuries because you can skate with like these injuries but you would definitely be more cautious about them and i kind of want to do some jumps and spins and if i have these in the back of my head i probably will be too scared to do those i am going to do a part two of me skating with these skates probably in a week or so I i'm sorry that this video ended up being just like me trying on these skates and just like working on edges and getting accustomed to them i really hope you like this video even though it is not what it was supposed to be i was supposed to do some jumps and spins in it as well but yeah, there will be a part two. If you want to see more videos of this, just go ahead and like, subscribe, and then turn on those post notifications so you know when to upload. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Also, by the way, I'm going to be posting on my ice skating Instagram page if you want to see more of me skating. I'm probably going to be uploading similar ones that I posted on here. And when I start skating again, I'll probably be posting that one before I post on here. Editing for YouTube and then editing for Instagram is a little bit different, so I'll see you.